Hey YouTube, it's me, Forever Essen here, and we are back for another video. And this time around, we are following on Best what we did last the time, sweet, which means, well, you guessed it, our boy, Arataki Ito, number uno Ito, <laughs> here in the flesh, right. and we are going to challenge all three of these guys and try to see how it turns out. If there is any other, you know, um, um, events or dialects that will be going on. And if you don't know, I recently uploaded to YouTube uh, my video for um, the 4.3 version special no program. And we're going back to Lee Wei for the Lantern Ride Festival. So, to you guys, Happy Lantern Ride Festival. I mean, I mean, Happy Lantern Ride in advance. Hope you'll get uh, some amazing memories. And uh, we'll also see Farina and Charlotte there, so. Quite excited about that. But with all of that, if you like the video on YouTube, please make sure to leave a like as it helps me greatly on this, in this ocean known as YouTube. And please also consider subscribing so that we may grow a number and uh, I mean, grow this community and this family ever so much. And I've also created my Patreon, so if you want to see even more of me in the future, well, you can always follow me over there. Or, and this is another option, Come uh, follow me here on Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash forever essen where we are uh, streaming I mean I mean I'm streaming but it's not always I mean the most I can do is um, once every two days so take it or leave it as they say <laughs> but um yeah thank you all for tuning in and thank you all for your support and without further ado guys let us begin <laughs> all right see it on my phone so best flavor in the world the sweet sweet taste right. of victory and that's why but i've now, never spent a single more on any of my snacks i've won them all fair and square <laughs> <laughs> that's right all right next up buttercup of terror but let me just make sure that we have um, everything here. Event details. So yeah, we do have these four that we have to do. Okay. Other trap of terror, Shan Shan. Oh, and she's here as well. Ah, that's so cool. <laughs> Only Kabuto are our friends, like cats and doggies. <laughs> Another kid? <laughs> oh, didn't we go through this last time? Oh, come on, Ito. Well, yeah, but Grandmaster Hanakano's a kid, too. And one of the other yeah. kids from last time was actually pretty good, so age is no measure of a beetle fighter's skill. True that. True that. Although, uh, Buttercup of Terror has no prior beetle battling experience, uh -huh. The chosen Onikabuto has the air of a formidable warrior. Hmm. I don't know what you guys are talking about. It's fine, it's fine. Not to worry about that. They have their shenanigans. <laughs> My Onikabuto was a present from Daddy. Oh. He got it from a new friend he made last time he was away. Oh, that is, is that right? Her Daddy. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, your father sounds like a real stand-up guy. Uh, yeah, he is. Yeah, he is, yeah. Okay, let's send out Sky Cleaving White Iron Lavender Melon for this one. <laughs> we don't want any accusations of bullying flying around. Any accusations of bullying flying around? <gasps> you make it sound like Paimon's the weakest choice on our side! <laughs> <sighs> the weakest choice? No, no, no. Only the second weakest choice. I'm the first, apparently. Still, my mind's probably the safest choice. But only because you two maniacs are a danger to yourselves and others when you're in a competitive mood. <laughs> look, look how she's smiling, though. 
Don't be nervous, young lady. It's only a game, so uh -huh. it's just for fun. It's just for fun. Uh, press the guard button to consume some stamina and form a shield against hostile electro bullets. Use guard right before an electro bullet hits to bounce it back. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, so what is the her uh, properties? Considerable long distance combat strength. So, bullet uh, electro bullets. Oh yeah. Attacks with lightning bullets. Very agile. All right. Ba Beetle battle boot camp is about to begin. So. Um, how do we do this again? Critters and cro and crawlies. Ow! How do you how do you, how do you guard? Don't remember. Oh. Oh, if you do it right, you can uh, do. So far, so good. Ouch. Oh. There. Okay, that's the book. Okay, so that's how you do it. Is uh, consequential, but hey, I'm doing this for the fun, nothing more. <laughs> oh, I mess that up. Uh, how? <laughs> how could you mess that up? Uh, oh, I nearly died of a heart attack. That little beastie is fierce. Even I would have had a hard time. <laughs> How'd you get so freaking good at this without a teacher? Is everyone in the UA a born warrior or something? I mean, maybe? So, this is how Oni Kabuto play together? I get it now! No, <laughs> oh, she's so cute. Uh, do you have time to play some more? Sure. And I also want to watch you guys play too. Well, stay for um, this Beetle Battle Boot Champ. As these butterflies have the cameo of their life. Hey, bull checker! If you had this kind of talent, you could probably have learned how to communicate with shelled creatures just by listening to Boba talk to Crystal Tornado. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, I wish. <laughs> Alright, I want to fight uh, by the Trap of Terror again. Or to battle her, rather. Uh, should you tell me about your nickname first? Would you like to play around with me? Yeah. You mean by the Trap of Terror? Yeah, yeah, tell me about it, please. 
Oh, it came about because Daddy once gave me a buttertrap flower, which I put by my windows, windowsill every night. But by the night's morning, it would have raced up to the roof. Someone said that they saw my flower climbing the walls in the dead of the night, just like a cat. It was later that we found that there was a cat in the city that had taken a link light into my plant, which led it to it making out for the plant. I don't know why, but as the story spread, it somehow became the buttertrap Shan Shan race turned into a cat. Terrifying. Not that I mind, but when that Grandmaster Avocado. Grandmaster Avocado. First inherited about this, they thought that my nickname was really cool and they even asked me to play this game. And well, I'm having lots of fun and I'd love to play more. So cute. Alright. Well, let's challenge her again, but this time, this time with the utmost difficulty. All right, I'm gonna learn how to fight a uh, white melon thing. Uh, I'm I'm going to get the challenge rewards after that. Let's get started. <clears throat> Ow. Okay, so that's how you do things. Alright. Let's make sure that everything... Okay, one, two. Oh. One, two. Let's continue. One, two. So far, so good, guys. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> One, two. Yeah, that's how you do it. <laughs> that's how you do it. Nice, nice. It's just the timing. Um, if you have the timing to block it perfectly, there won't be any worries. Only Chaputo are just as obedient as cats and dogs. This kind of, of competition is really fun. Tell me about it. It's really exciting, to say the least. Okay, Shan Shan, Butter Chapter, done. Nice, nice, nice. A terrifying opponent approaches. A new, a new challenger on the block. Considerable long distance combat strength, attacks with lightning bolts, and very agile. Yeah. Okay. Nice. I think that the next one that we will have to do is. Related to a certain person that we see here? A certain lawyer of Leeway? Someone who knows about um, the laws and uh, how to deal with contracts and such, and such things, right? Contestant with super OP gear. Yanfei. Let's go. Hey there, I'm back. So then, how's the Arataki Blazing Armor Beetle Battle Boot Camp coming along? <sighs> you can you can trust Arataki Ito to found to find the most complicated mouthful uh, sentences ever to describe what he's thinking about. And of course, there's a lot of alterations there. Alright. Awesome timing, I, I would say. My savior! Oh, thanks for helping out with the permit. Oh, and for the sign <laughs> with the epic artwork. Yeah. 
Yeah, she did um, help us with the, the, I mean, help him with the permit. And uh, Shinobu was uh, really angry about that. <laughs> Wait, I know that look. Are you uh, looking to flip some beetle too? <laughs> Learn to flip some beetle. His voice actor is definitely great. I had to say. Huh? Something wrong with that? I have a big client who does a lot of cross-border commerce. Anyway, she showered me with gifts once after I helped her win a huge lawsuit. And among them was a very special Onikabuto. Oh, okay. I didn't know how to look after it at the time, so I got Granny to look after it for a while. It's looking pretty buff these days. <laughs> Mind if I join in? You're not worried about pink. Panther's style, are you? Definitely not. Join in, Yanfei. I can't wait to battle you. We ought not dismiss your savior, Oni King. What she lacks in experience, she uh. makes up for with one of the sturdiest built and most awe-inspiring Onikabuto I've ever seen. Alright. <laughs> and... And Sean Sean saying Grandmaster Avocado. When it's Grandmaster Avocado. <sighs> you make me an offer I can't refuse. Mm -hmm. All right, time to send in the Oni King's right hand with Crimson Staff. I know my compadre <laughs> will stay cool under pressure. You betcha. <laughs> So it's me versus the Traveler? All right. Yeah. I haven't quite got the hang of this game yet. So, apologies in advance for any blunders. It's nice, it's nice that they have a battle stance when <laughs> the only one, the only ones actually fighting are the Beatles themselves. <laughs> yeah, it's quite funny. All right. I can't. I can't help but having a smile, a smile on my face, while doing this event. It it's so, so wholesome. It's so funny and exciting at the same time. Uh, so what's that only chapter properties? Impressive melee combat strength. Okay, attacks with weights. All right. Well, let's see how it turns out. Ooh. <laughs> oh. You won't get me with that thing. Come on. Defense, it seems. Oh, seems like there's quite a lot of beetle battles. Yes, Yanfei, there definitely is more than meets the eye. Definitely. Yanfei's only Kabuto is so strong. What is Madam Penguin beating that thing? I don't know. Maybe um, rocks. Or um, maybe she has been filling uh, the Sunny Chapito in one of the um, adeptal, ad adeptal realms. Where, yeah, adeptal powers. See? Your savior's only Kabuto is a force to be reckoned <clears throat> with. But just like last time, when my general threw you a few curveballs. The mightiest blade cannot slay its foe except in the hands of a skilled swordmaster. Uh -huh. w w why wise words, Grandmaster? <laughs> He's so confused. Oh, okay. Good thing my compadre kept it together. So, oh, he had a heart attack. <laughs> he, was, he almost had a heart attack. 
Wow, what a blast. Mm -hmm. I could get into this whole beetle battling thing. I guess we'll see some uh, return faces if they do this event more and more in the future. <sighs> this is so much fun. Thanks, everyone. I'm gonna stick around and play some more. Sure. I mean, we still have that rematch that, uh, I mean, not rematch, but... Yeah, I still have to battle with you some more, you know, to the utmost strength. Alright. Uh, let's go back to her. I'll have to remember to also to change uh, the, the elemental powers of the traveler for the festivities when when it comes. I'll change it back to Geo because it's quite fitting, you know, Manton right being in leeway. So yeah, and then I'll switch it back to Hydra because uh, that's the dominant color it seems until this point. Uh, been busy lately, Leo. <laughs> I can't even speak right now. Been busy lately, Yonfei, huh? Oh, I'm fine. I'm good. <clears throat> I mean, even legal experts. Yeah, yeah that's what I was um, <clears throat> trying to say. Uh, even legal experts don't have business to attend to every day, you know? Which is just as well. While my fellow disciples are having their reunion, I'm going to spend in all my annual leave. I mean, you do you, girl. I'll eat my fill, sleep my dew, play to my heart's content, and then go back to my work refreshed and renewed. That's a great plan. Now that's what they call a happy life. Indeed, indeed. Alright. Let's continue. I think that it will be even more hard this time around. Okay, let's, let's get focused. This was a doozy. I almost, <laughs> I almost lost there. Um, yes, there's no shortcuts to becoming good at any game. Yeah, definitely there isn't. It's uh, rinse and repeat until you get good at it. Yansfei, just contestant with super OP gear. Danzo. Get these butterflies while we add it. I saw more, but I don't know where they are. I'm sure I've seen more butterflies, but maybe they disappear? Oh, anyways. The OST here. The piano. 
Yeah, I miss. I am clearly miss the leeway vibes. It's quite nostalgic. I'm going on to crazy things with uh, Sumeru, Sumeru the Chasm. I mean, albeit the, tra the Chasm is still in the leeway region, but yeah, Sumeru and uh, Fontaine. It's been quite the journey, and it's not even done yet. So <laughs> I'm excited. Lan, what are you doing so far from <laughs> from the Adventurers Guild? Should not be here. I mean, no frills, instant kill. Uh, yeah, well, I, yeah, I guess we'll see about that. All right, Lan, talk to me. Walk with me. This, this makes no sense. How, how did you do that? My, my reputation is destroyed! <laughs> <laughs> because it's, it's an adventurous it's guild? like a bean to the heart. <laughs> like a bean to the heart. <laughs> it was an honor doing battle with you, good sir. Oh, he... He battled with her <laughs> and lost. Poor Ito. What the? So polite. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, been busy losing while we were away, Bullchucker? Bonafide beetle battle chain. Bullchucker. Uh huh. <laughs> By a month to sass. And the trail of being as happy as can be. I don't see it that way. Unless the bona fide beetle battle king is ready to give up now, he hasn't lost to me yet. Huh? In battle and in life, it's normal to hit setbacks every once in a while. Yeah. But a setback only turns into a failure if you make the decision to stop trying. That's, um, it's definitely life advice here, guys. Be sure to. As um, someone in Kingdom Hearts um, always says, got memorized. Word. Heck yeah! I ain't about to admit defeat yet. <laughs> Still, there's nothing to be gained from constantly making excuses. <clears throat> Don't put all your energy into talking garbage. Spend it on fighting a little harder instead. Oh. Yeah, that's quite a burn, my bro. <laughs> Pony King, this brand of enemy doesn't seem to be your area of expertise. I advise you send in another of your generals and observe the duel in detail. Ooh. Watching others do battle is also a crucial part of a warrior's training. Uh -huh. Some skills one learns by doing, others one learns through observation. Yeah, that's definitely true. Ah, good point, Grandmaster. And good timing, compadre. Oni King's right hand, I'm handing the fight over to you. <laughs> you got it, bro. Ah, finally, it's your turn. Make it count, Traveler. How? What do you mean, it, finally, it's my turn? I've been battling Yanfei just quite, just quite a few minutes ago. What do you mean? <laughs> Piece of change. So, I'm going head to head with the legendary Traveler. Oh, yes. Guess I better look sharp. Or you should, <laughs> because I'm not about to go easy on you. The raise, okay. Uh, holding the guard button, so okay, will continuously consume stamina to maintain the shield against hostile jet streams. All right. Uh, oh, I haven't received the rewards yet for this thing. In wait. What? 
Is there some profound mysterious principle underlying beetle fighting? A terrifying opponent approaches? Interested new trauma? Less blah blah, more beetle battling. You got it. Uh, so what are these properties here? Impressive long distance combat strength. Attacks with various electro strikes and extremely agile. Impressive long distance combat strength because of the uh, jet streams. And attacks with various electro strikes. Let's do this. So I have to remember to block. Ah, uh, there. It seems a lot of stamina though. Ah, uh, I don't have enough stamina though. Okay, uh, I have to. Jet stream here, guys. Oh, it wasn't the jet stream. But this is the jet stream. Ah! Okay. Let's move it. Ouch! Okay. I have to focus. Well. <laughs> Well, that's uh, that's done. Wasn't really as uh, practical as <laughs> it could have been, but hey, you you can't you can't sway the results here. You don't argue with the results. I beat her. Fair and square. You're amazing. Thanks for showing me how it's done. You're welcome. Nicely done. You beat me. Yeah. I'd go as far as to say that it's an honor to lose against the traveler. <laughs> ah, so that's how you do it. I never would have thought of that. Hey. Can all this practice with me? Yep. When you're up against a cunning enemy, you gotta get creative. Oh, yes. When your tactics fail, you have to change your point of view. In our journeys far and wide, we often have to think on our feet. <laughs> um, well, when we have to think on our feet, what Paimon means to say is that I do the thinking. Most of the time, actually. She's just there along for... company's sake. Or, at times, emergency food. Nah, I love you, Paimon. The problem, no matter how hard you try. I think Shinobu said something like that once, too. Mm -hmm. I guess there's something to it after all. Yeah. But I'll mull it over some other time. Right now, my focus is on the task at hand. More beetle fighting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, um, let me, um, let me, um, yeah, let me, uh, Kuba? Yeah, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a little, um, intimidated by the stove god. Chalamages, Chalosis, Chalant, Crushmore. 
Okay, Lon, uh, let's do our, our stuff here. Uh, but first, Lon, I have to ask you a specific question here. Uh, so, um, you enjoy Battle Beetle... Be uh, Battle Beetles. <sighs> so you enjoy Beetle Battles, too. I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say that I enjoy it. I simply think that there's something to learn from many activities, so it wouldn't hurt to give it a go. We often get a lot of non-combat related requests mixing uh, with our high difficulty transmissions, which most of the time you give to me. But that's beside the point. Solving mechanical puzzles, following clues to search for specific objects. Yeah, we've seen it all. You never know when you might even encounter a mission that requires a command over creatures to fulfill a certain objective. Yeah. Command over creatures. Uh, yeah, the Fungi Fantastic Fiesta. Anyone remembers that event? You have to command other creatures to fulfill a certain objective. Albeit it's a tournament, or competition of sorts. I'm sure that you, of all people, would have experience with that. Yes. But uh, that's not why I'm here. I'm here to battle you. Let's go for it. Alright. Let me, uh, oh. I should get this, the rewards after the fact, not before. Alright, utmost might. Uh, let's go. Okay, so I have to remember the pattern here. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Ooh. Three times in a oh 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 okay. Whew. Jet three. Okay. Whew, whew, whew. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. I mean, sure. <laughs> okay. Uh, <clears throat> You're truly strong. Not a single weakness to exploit. I'm unbeatable. But I might eat my words when I come face to face with um, the legend here. Wooba. It's a challenge in and of itself. Ultimate trial. So that was an interesting newcomer. Alright. Okay, let's get this. So that was the lawn. Alright. <sighs> Are you guys ready? Arataki numero uno ito here in the flesh. <laughs> you know, it's time for you to uh, uh, get ready, which is uh, 